Hello everybody, I've got a better camera. Usually I use this, which is a uh, HP PhotoSmart 3635 camera, which is only at 2.1 megapixels, where this one I'm on right now is 4.1, so much better. Um, I'm going to redo that video with the laptop, Dell, Inspiron 3800. Um, okay, so, really good laptop. I've got an upgraded screen from what I had. Actually, I've also got another one. If you haven't seen my other video. Um, this one I have in pieces. This is the screen I had on before. Which is, I believe, a 12 inch or it's a 13 inch. Anyway, really bad. And it turned out the screen broke down there somewhere. So, this is another one. It's oh, This one's only a Celeron, but it's still almost the same. This one's a Pentium 3 processor running at 700 megahertz. This one runs at only 550, I believe. And Pentium 3, I've upgraded it to a 40 gig hard drive. So, I have 40 gig Fujitsu hard drive on here. And I think it's... It doesn't say it on here, but... It's on there. Um, this computer, I'll show you the ports. Okay. There's hard drive slot right there. Where, I mean, hard drive right there. Um, speaker, I think these are, these two are Kensington locks. Um, two PCI slots. PCI MA slots, actually. So I can... Toss in two things. Okay. Uh, two Ethernet. Three Ethernet things because this computer does not have an Ethernet port on it. Um, power, infrared, serial, PS2, USB 1.1. This is a Dell um, special one to uh, dock. Printer parallel, VGA out, fan, which really be really annoying. There's a heater in there, modem, S video out. Actually, I think that's a specialty video out, but anyway. And then you got your basic line in, headphone, mic in, and then another speaker. In the front, I have my DVD drive. Which comes out. It's a DVD drive. It has 24 times CD and 24 times DVD, which is pretty good for DVD. Should run them pretty smoothly. Um, this computer originally came with Windows 98, although I never had Windows 98 on this. Well, yeah, I did for a little bit, but that only lasted about three days. Um, I don't have anything to open up, but that's where the RAM is. It's got I've got two 128 megabyte sticks of RAM in there. I've got a battery. I've got actually like three or four of these, but this one's it'll do it. The laptop actually weighs quite a bit for standard laptops. Like if you have two batteries in here, which I do have most of the time, because I don't usually have my DVD drive with me most of the time. This one has I believe like a 15 or a 4.1 inch monitor I'm pretty 14.1 sorry pretty sure it's 14.1 um I like the design of this keyboard um I think Dell has done a really good job with this keyboard it uh still pretty good I it has this little mouse in the front here like it's a little stick it doesn't really move at all it'll move the screen move the mouse on the screen Use these to click. It's also got a half decent touchpad. It's okay. The only thing is what I don't like is it takes it will take you a couple times strokes to get it up to the top of the screen. Um got two clicks, little latch. This computer actually does have a latch, it's not magnetic like most laptops these days. Um power cord, bill. It'll say Inspiron 3800 down there. Um, little lights. This computer has function, has functions. Um, so 
will have functions like F5 does something, F8, if you press function it'll put it onto CRT. This one takes out the CD drive, it has your volume buttons up here. Um, yeah, this keyboard is very well laid out, it is full size, and it still has the buttons here. So, still got full size shift, enter key, which is good. So it's about the same size. Back to my PC cards, I've got an SMC one here that sticks out, which I hate. I got this Hexacom one, which uses an adapter right in there, which I have here. So it uses a special adapter with huge end on it, where the thing goes in there. I got this 3COM one, which is actually a double spaced one, so it takes up two spaces, but it doesn't. So it is bigger. But it doesn't have a end sticking out or an extra cable like this one did. But the only thing is I kind of broke it, so there's wires in there. A little messed up. Um, like I said, I have a 40 gig hard drive in here, which is upgraded. When my dad got it for me, I had a 10, like one of these. Originally, these laptops came with six hard drives, six gig hard drives, which are like these. And I have another Toshiba one, which doesn't work on these. And so on. So, these are the two laptops. One worse than the other. And, like I said, Pentium 3 runs Windows 2000 Professional, NT Workstation 4.0, Windows 98, all fairly smoothly. I have it dual booted with Linux and Linux Xubuntu 8.10 and Windows 2000. Each on about 15, about 15 or 18 gig partitions which isn't bad so that's pretty much my review like I said this should be in better quality because better camera that's it um, I'll be trying to upload a couple more videos with this camera better than this piece of crap which I have used it's really not anything so that's why it's horrible okay thanks for watching